Dear students, many of us do not know why or how to do unit conversion. At first, we will learn why we need to know the conversion of unit. We know that pressure, volume, temperature and molar gas constant are different quantities. They have different units in different systems. For example, in the SI system, the unit of pressure is Newton per meter square or Pascal. But in the liter atmosphere system, the unit of pressure is ATM. When we read stimulus, we see that different different units are used for different different quantities. What should we do when different units of different systems are used in stimulus? For example, look at the stimulus of Rashi board 2019. See, in this container, the unit of volume is liter, which belongs to liter ATM system. But in this container, the unit of volume is meter cube, which belongs to SI or MKS system. All different units have been used in this stimulus. In this situation, either we have to convert this liter ATM unit to this SI unit, or we have to convert this SI unit to this liter ATM unit. Thus, we can solve mathematical problems through unit conversion. Now we will learn how to convert units. Actually, we can take any system we like, but we will always try to solve mathematical problems using liter ATM units in chemistry. That means we will always convert the pressure of any unit into ATM unit. We will always convert the volume of any unit into liter unit. We will always convert the temperature of any scale in Kelvin scale. And last of all, we will always take the value of the molar gas constant R, which is fixed for liter ATM system. That is 0.0821 liter ATM per mole per Kelvin. But for the gaseous chapter of physics first paper chapter 10, we have to convert all the different units in the units of SI or MK system. Look at the chart. This is a chart of the units of different systems. The unit of pressure in this SI system is Newton per meter square or Pascal. But the unit of pressure in this liter ATM system is ATM. And the unit of pressure in this CGS system is dyne per centimeter. The unit of volume in this system is meter cube. But the unit of volume in this system is liter. And the unit of volume in this system is centimeter cube. There is no reason to worry about temperature, as Kelvin unit is common for each system. The value of molar gas constant R in this system is 8.314 Joule per mole per Kelvin or 8.314 Newton meter per mole per Kelvin. And the value of molar gas constant R in this liter ATM system is 0.0821 liter ATM per mole per Kelvin. Now look at this another chart. This is a chart of relationships between different units of pressure. One ATM equals 76 centimeter mercury pressure equals 760 millimeter mercury pressure equals 101325 
নিউটন পার মিটার স্কোয়ার ইকুয়ালস ওয়ান জিরো ওয়ান পয়েন্ট থ্রি টু ফাইভ কিলো প্যাসকেল ইকুয়ালস ওয়ান পয়েন্ট জিরো ওয়ান ইন্টু টেন টু দি পাওয়ার ফাইভ প্যাসকেল নাও উই উইল লার্ন হাউ টু কনভার্ট দিস ডিফারেন্ট প্রেশার ইউনিটস টু এটিএম ইউনিট Suppose we have got 750 mm mercury pressure given in a stimulus. This unit is not an ATM unit. Now, we have to convert this unit into ATM unit. Look at the chart. See, 760 mm mercury pressure equals 1 ATM. How many ATM do we get for 1 mm mercury pressure? We get 1 mm mercury pressure equals 1 over 760 atm. So, for this 750 ml mercury pressure, how many atm do we get? We get 1 times 750 over 760. That is 0 0.986 atm. Look at this another chart. This is a chart of relationships between different units of volume. 1 liter equals 1 decimeter cube equals 1000 milliliter equals 1000 centimeter cube equals 10 inverse 3 meter cube equals 1 kg equals 1000 gram. 1 milliliter equals 1 centimeter cube equals 1 gram and 1 meter cube equals 1000 liter equals 10 to the power 6 centimeter cube equals 1000 kg. Now we will learn how to convert these different volume units to ATM unit. Suppose we have got volume V equals 300 milliliter in a stimulus. This unit is not an ATM unit. Now we have to convert this unit into ATM unit. That means we have to convert this milliliter unit into liter unit. Now look at the chart. 1000 milliliter equals 1 liter. Therefore 1 milliliter equals 1 over 1000 milliliter. Therefore, this 300 milliliter equals 1 times 300 milliliter over 1000 milliliter. That means 0 0.3 liter. Do remember, in the formula of EK equals 3 over 2 small n RT, we must take the value of molar gas constant R in SI unit. Because the terms of kinetic energy is related to physics. I hope after watching this tutorial, there will be no more fear among us about unit conversion. Many many thanks for watching this tutorial.